Hey everybody, uh, thank you for being a customer of ActiveWoo, or if you're watching this video considering if you wanna grab it, I'm gonna just quickly walk you through how you set up the deep data integration between ActiveWoo and ActiveCampaign. So the first thing you need to do is make sure that you have your API turned on and that you're also using WooCommerce version three. If you're not on at least version three, you'll need to update to version three before you can enable the REST API here and save changes and also to make sure that everything else is going to work uh, properly. Once you've got that turned on and you're still logged into your uh, WordPress, you'll come over to Active Campaign, and then you'll go to My Settings. Then you click on Integrations and then click Add Integration. Then choose WooCommerce. Then just simply paste your domain like so. and connect. And then hit approve. When it's done, uh, you'll see that it's connected and you can just click done. Once that's all handled, come back over here and then click on your integration tab. Check the enable deep data integration box and then you're gonna wanna click save changes. Once you've done that and you've made a sale, you'll see a new e-commerce area in between the custom fields on a contact and uh, the notes and tasks and everything. And so here you're gonna see total revenue. Now, if you've been using ActiveWoo for a while, you might already have a total revenue field. So for example, I do in the custom fields and it's just called revenue. I've also got the last order field and uh, some other test fields that I, I use from time to time. The big difference uh, between deep data and what uh, ActiveWoo has done all along and continues to do can be found once you dive into the order. And here you can actually see uh, the specific products and sometimes I believe if there's a quantity, uh, you can see the total quantity of uh, given products purchased in a given order. Now the way that ActiveWoo uh, still manages to tell you what product was purchased is through the SKU and, uh, and it tags. So the ActiveWoo here uh, product was purchased, so that's why that tag is here. The, this is the abandoned cart uh, tag. This is my default tag, that it's a customer. And I believe the WooCommerce customer is the uh, deep data integration that um, ActiveCampaign adds automatically. So once again, you get uh, this little e-commerce area, total revenue, total orders, and total products purchased. And for those of you who do not uh, have deep data, who aren't gonna pay for the plus account, all of the same information is still available. If you have it uh, enabled in the settings, you can track total orders. Um, I'm not tracking total products purchased, just total orders. So you'll be able to always see total revenue, total orders, and the date of the last order. And also, you will also get notes here, which I found to be a little bit more handy than just giving you the, uh, uh, the order number. Down in the notes, you'll always get a link that you can click on that'll just jump you straight back to that order in your uh, WooCommerce. So that's a quick tutorial on deep data integration. As more deep data features get added by ActiveCampaign, then uh, you'll be sure that you'll see them also added to ActiveWoo in the future. Thanks again for checking out the video and for using ActiveWoo.